we dropped her off at school, close to school. Um, she wanted to walk the rest of the way. Um, I'm not sure what I'm allowed to share. You can share whatever you feel comfortable sharing. I know you had conversations with detectives. Um, not sure what that conversation is, <clears throat> but whatever you feel comfortable sharing that will put the awareness out there. Yeah, she was uh, spotted walking uh, by the church, by the middle school uh, on the cameras. They saw her hang out in the parking lot for a little bit and then get up and leave. They didn't see a vehicle or anything else. They just saw her walk away uh, around 9 a.m. heading towards the school, but she never made it. Um, yeah. What has the school said? Have you given any contact with the school? Yes, um, that they're doing everything they can. They've given me all their resources. The principals called me. They've looked at their cameras. Cameras. Um, I don't think they've caught anything on the cameras. It's too far away from the sidewalk. Everything is too grainy, so they can't see specific faces. Um, but they've looked. Um, so I'm just waiting to hear anything else from them. Is this normal behavior? Not at all. To just not show up or call or text or anything? Not at all, no. Um, she... From time to time, she will leave her cell phone at home accidentally, and that's actually what happened yesterday. She left her phone at home. She went to school. Um, but that happens from time to time. She's got ADHD, uh, her memory. <laughs> She's very forgetful. Um, so, yeah, there's no way to track her right now because I have, well, the detectives now have her phone. Uh, but this isn't normal behavior, no. What was the last thing, I guess, that the conversation that you two had, you and your daughter? Um, we spoke about her birthday party. She had a birthday party on Sunday. Uh, she had a great time. Uh, I couldn't make it because I was working. But she had an amazing time. She was so happy with all her gifts. Uh, I, I told her good night, and um, yeah, that was it. I. I I wasn't the one who took her to school in the morning. That was my partner. Um, but yeah. 13? She's 13 years old, yeah. 13. Madeline? Madeline. Madeline. Um, what are you thinking right now? In my heart, I feel like somebody took her. This isn't like her to just pick up and run away um, or just not go to school. Um, I, don't know, I don't know what to think. Friends, the friend's parents, you've contacted and Everyone. went through every single person? Everyone that we know that she knows. We've contacted them all, reached out to them. The parents have gone out to search and look for her as well. We haven't come up with anything yet. I've seen a lot of posts on uh, Facebook, um, Hunter's Creek, rants and raves and what have you. Did people um, say that they were going to conduct some type of like search party or anything? Uh, a lot of people have asked me to volunteer. Like if, if there is one, if the, if they can do one, um, there I have people passing out flyers, going to every store in that vicinity, a gas station, church. Um, I think people people were being stopped in the street this morning in front of the school to see if they've seen anything, if they've heard anything. My family is, they're going all out right now. 